What's good, good y'all? It's the Duma Shots React, react and we're back with another video. video. What we got today, Sierra? Today we'll be reacting to a hundred people tell us about their worst Ooh. breakup. Yeah, I heard that right. Worst breakup. This should be interesting. Yes. This should be interesting. So, if you are new, make sure you scroll down and press the red subscribe button and turn on the post notification bell mm -hmm. and check out the pinned comment. We have some good information in there, okay? Help us get to 10K. That's the go. All right? And truly appreciate y'all. Without further ado, let's get into the video. When I kicked one of my ex... When I kicked one of my exes out, gave him a check so he could get a new apartment, he got one in the same complex so he could see <coughs> the apartment from his. <laughs> That's weird. That's really weird. That's weird. He said, we're going to be apart, but not too far apart. Mm -mm. <laughs> Where's the breakup? Yeah. Um, ooh. I think I blocked all of them out. Where's the breakup? Where's the breakup? Uh, what about it? Tell me about it. It was rough. First person I fell in love with. My first, like, serious boyfriend kind of, like, just left in the middle of the night. We had been dating for so long. It was, like, four years. Four years. Oh. Really left in like the middle of the night and just like took my shit like sorry i'm out we were living together and it seemed like everything was going great it just came out of nowhere for me i even told him my parents thought he was going to propose to me she broke up with me on christmas eve valentine's day right before my birthday ended over text text dumped me over facebook messenger i did not reply i thought i loved them they had such and with scissors <laughs> Maximus. What was with her? My current girlfriend. With my current fiance, actually. We broke up for like sort of on and off. On and off. On and off. Break up, get back together again. He break up with me. Break up, get back together again. You want to get back together and I was all happy. Break up. Are we dating? Are we not? Sleep with each other's best friends. Ew. And then like two months later he break up with me again. I was just like totally shocked. And then get back together again. Why? We really, really like forced making it work for a long time. My daughter was a couple months old. It literally took him being abusive to her to open my eyes and saying, wait, what the hell what am I doing? Wait, what? My ex <laughs> wanted to make me choose between him and my kid. He yeah, decided okay. that he couldn't claim her because I was mixed with black. Nobody did. When I left my daughter's father, my kid's dad, the ex-husband, ex-wife, I lost everything. She would take my balls if she could. I paid off my credit card to buy her an engagement ring, showed it to her and everything she didn't care. He was in prison and he got out and things just changed. I opted for an abortion and I thought I had his support. It was just really messy, nasty, crappy. Agonizing. That's not like juicy. We just was like, this isn't working. <laughs> Lame. You don't want to hear like that. Her dog chased after me. You get bit. No, you wanted, you wanted to go with me. She stole my dog. I still miss her, but my dog. Found out he was talking to a girl while we were still dating. I got cheated on. I guess that kind of sucks. Cheated, cheated, cheated. 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 She had been basically seeing someone else the whole time. I was basically a placeholder, and she was perfect for me. She was bad shit, bananas. She kicked me in the face. He was like, I don't even want to try heroin. He slept with my manager, and then he slept with my coworker, and then a year later, him and my coworker got married. Whoa. And that's when I decided to quit. No, that's I have never had a breakup. Never been in a relationship. So if anyone was to hit me up, you know, I'm ready. <laughs> I feel like I've been broken up so <coughs> times. I can't believe I can't even think of one. Everybody breaks up with you? Yeah. I technically kicked him out. I care about myself and my feelings enough to not stay with a person that is not serving me. I was a real dick. I chose the school over being with her. I realized I was gay and I made the whole thing about me and didn't even consider that he had been in this relationship for two years and was like very much in love with me. It's just like, you're just like ripping their heart out. It's just like, it's horrible. She threatened to kill herself when I left. And uh, I was like, everything I do right now, I'm going to defer to later because the stakes are too high. Someone asked me to marry them and it was at a market outside and I said no and they started crying. I felt really bad. Married and he married and then it's like, nope. And then I'm like, okay, you know. No, wow. We were doing long distance and I realized I was in love with someone else. Did some things I shouldn't have done. I wonder why I was hurt when I'm the one that decided 
to cheat. I had all these chances to do the right thing, and and I didn't. I was very much like the bad guy. It's like probably the only thing in my life that I like truly regret. I didn't like his dog. I I actually don't like dogs. Um, I tried to make it work, but I didn't like his dog, so I broke up with him. <laughs> what? Um, one time I broke up with somebody at a Wendy's parking lot. She almost ran me over with her car. Got frosted. Right, but it's so... He had all his teammates yeah. pee on my fucking Wait. car. Peed the bed all the time. Wait, what? I found mm -hmm. bottles of piss all around the apartment. He's just like a whack nigga. Cheers to you, ho. Fuck you. Fuck you, Wayne. Ooh, bad words, bad words. You're a piece of trash. I reacted in a way that later caused me a little bit of shame. You know, being vindictive and vengeful and just wanting him to feel the pain that was caused to me. Okay. And I'm like, oh, no, no, why don't you love me? Oh, God. <laughs> please, please. I think I went kind of insane. Thinking, you know, what would have happened? She had a baby boy, and you know, she named it all after me. And you know, I cannot figure out why she did it, though. No. <laughs> I just got out of a five year relationship. I just didn't see myself marrying him or being with him too much longer. It was late at night and we took a walk and we went real slow because he knew that when we got back to the car, I'd just drive him home and that would be it. And that was it. Why are you worried? I haven't talked to him since. I, I tried to open the door and she shut it and then I ended up like breaking down in her arms. You over? Am I over? No. Aww. If you're sharing life with somebody else and they leave, they took half of your life with them. It felt like everything kind of fell off the face of the planet. How'd you get over it? Smoked some weed. I was drinking. I moved. <laughs> took a long time to grieve. I tried to get run over by a car. And then I also overdosed. I tried to overdose. No. Soft therapist for a few months and she really helped me. It's like, okay, yeah, like, you know, you're good, you're not the crazy one type of thing. Kudos to my parents for taking a three o'clock call in the morning to me sobbing and being like, the fuck is Jared? But my mom was like already ready to murder him. I just started dating someone for the first time ever. What do you think it's gonna be like? The breakup? <laughs> got run over by a car. People weird. My man said I couldn't understand why I was hurt when I'm the one that cheated. My my head. Yo, um People crazy. We apologize for the profanity. Y'all know we don't have that in our videos. Y'all let us know what y'all want us to react to. Yeah, this. definitely. Yeah. Because, um. Excuse the watch. Superman, Spider Man, whatever it's called. Oh, child. Like, comment, subscribe, and share. I don't know about this. <laughs>